Hello, my name is Gary Malkowski. I am the Special Advisor to the President, Public Affairs at the Canadian Hearing Society, CHS. I am thrilled to announce, in conjunction with the International Day of Persons with Disabilities, CHS has launched the Barrier Free Education Project in partnership with the Ministry of Education and School Boards. This project was developed for educators and parents of children that are deaf and hard of hearing. The Classroom Accessibility Guide is geared towards teachers to help them understand what is encompassed in an accessible classroom. We also have the Mental Health Guide to Support Parents and Teachers. This is entitled, A Guide to Support the Mental Health and Well-Being of Children and Youth Who Are Deaf and Hard of Hearing in Ontario Schools. The third component we are offering is webinars for educators. These videos will inform educators on how to provide support to their deaf and hard of hearing students in their classroom. The webinars are geared towards educators and school board administration to inform and advise them on three important topics. The first webinar is entitled Anti-Autism and Language Accessibility. This two-part webinar is designed to provide accessibility information to teachers, and school board decision makers who are involved in the long-term planning toward accessibility for Ontarians with disability standards. Technology and Human Resources in the Education of Students Who Are Deaf and Hard of Hearing is the second webinar. This is divided into two parts with the focus of how to utilize and maintain technology used by students who are deaf and hard of hearing to access signed and or spoken language as well as best practices for assessing and programming to meet the needs and abilities of deaf and hard of hearing students. The third webinar Language Foundations for Students Who Are Deaf and Hard of Hearing encourages professionals to reflect on how they can work together to identify ways to provide language access to students who are deaf and hard of hearing. Upon this reflection, an inclusive, accessible, and barrier-free environment will be established, one that strengthens learning and reduces gaps in student achievement. Student success ultimately depends on providing learners with an accessible environment where they feel supported and where they face no attitudinal barriers. It is only then will they flourish in and out of the classroom as healthy individuals with a sense of well-being. Let's celebrate the International Day of Persons with Disabilities on December 3rd, 2015. For more information regarding the Barrier Free Education Project, please go to our website at www.chs.ca backslash barrier free for more information.